Hello, and welcome to this quick presentation on Bonex, a tool that uses artificial intelligence to diagnose tumors and tumor-like conditions of the bone. With over 50 bone tumors and tumor-like conditions, and each tumor having hundreds of features, it can be a daunting task for a radiologist to accurately diagnose a bone tumor. With Bonex, a user-friendly program, this task becomes very easy. Let me show you how. As pioneers of using artificial intelligence for medical applications since 1990, we found there was an opportunity to use AI in the diagnosis of bone tumors. Our program now consists of a single screen consultation interface that can be accessed by simply clicking on the start menu within the application. The consultation screen opens and prompts the user to select or deselect appropriate features based on what they observe on a plain radiography. These features are grouped into 12 categories, but as you can see, all the features are clearly laid out, making this an easy task. To ensure the user is correctly choosing the feature, they can select the button Visuals located on the right lower corner. A window will then open and allow the user to view sketches and x-rays of the different features. This can also be used as an educational tool as it helps the user learn the different terminology. In this example, the user is unsure whether or not there is a Codman triangle in the bone tumor. This graphic clearly illustrates the key appearance of this feature. Bonex also incorporates the use of real x-rays to make it easier for the users to compare images with the x-ray in hand. Once a diagnosis push button is clicked, the program rapidly constructs a summary report and also provides a list of diagnostic possibilities. Each diagnostic possibility is assigned a percentage of likelihood based on the selected features on the previous screen. To limit the number of differential diagnoses, the user can select either of three thresholds, greater than 55, 60, or 65% probability. Here's an example of why showing differential diagnosis can be so important. The description above is based on a case presented at RSNA as a case of the day. The patient was unfortunately diagnosed with osteomyelitis by the radiologist, but later was found to have Ewing sarcoma, as the program had indicated. This concludes our quick demo of Bonex. We hope to expand this application to include CT and MRI features of the tumor and to attract collaborators. Thank you for taking the time to listen, and please do not hesitate to contact us should you have any additional questions.